Yeah. Yeah. It's day 11 of Vlogmas. We only have 14 days until Christmas. Hmm. I've had a cup of coffee and now I'm going to drink hot chocolate. I'm going to use this hot chocolate bomb that my sister gave me yesterday, y'all. Mm -mm. Before you say anything, yes, I'm doing this in my bed because my hips are hurting. So let me, let me figure out. Shit. I'm filming in my bed because my hips hurt. But let's watch this. Never done one of these before. It's supposed to dissolve when you pour the milk on it. But guess what? It's not doing it. It's not melting. And it was really hot. Y'all saw it steaming. Maybe if I stir it. Hmm. Oh, it is starting to... Oh. It's like melting. i never done one of these before, y'all. It's pretty cool. It's got marshmallows in it. What? That's sorcery if I ever saw it. It's supposed to be chocolate mint. And it's Dunkin', so you know it should for sure be good. Oh, that was fun. I hope y'all enjoyed it. That was cool. Oh, my sister's cool. She gave me a bomb. <laughs> my sister gave me a bomb. Hmm. If it was me giving them a bomb, it might not have been a chocolate one. We won't talk about that. Shh. Don't tell nobody. Hi, y'all. It's me, Neva, from Magnet Mama Musings, and I'm out of bed for a minute. <laughs> um, no, my body hurts. We've got a cold front coming in. Those steroids were helping. I ain't got much sleep last night and the night before. Sorry. And uh, then I woke up this morning, and we're supposed to get down in the 20s tonight. And, oh, I can feel it in my whole body. I don't know if any of y'all have fibro or any of y'all have, you know, stuff going on. Where, but you, if you know, you know. Yeah, so we, I'm headed right now. That's what I came on here to tell you. I'm headed right now to wait at Walmart for... A fellow YouTuber, they're not Yarny, but they'll be my shout out today. It's called the Hatter House. Um, they live in the town that my bestie lives in. Well, I won't be heading that way right away, and I made my bestie's mom some fingerless gloves and an ear warmer, the pink ones that I I haven't shown y'all. But since I'm delivering them right now, I will um, put pictures in the video. I forgot. I shared them on Facebook, but I haven't showed them here. Bad Neva. So anyway, I'm headed over there to wait at Walmart for them because they're only here so long. But they're doing pickup for their groceries. And uh, so yeah, I'm going to meet them over there. Can y'all tell I just woke up? Oh, just got out of bed. I should say my face kind of swollen. Um, I'm headed over there so that I can deliver that and then I'm going to give her some scrunchies that I made her um, Lori that is and an ear warmer for a thank you for delivering that for me plus she has been watching my videos to give me um, watch hours and so uh, my shout out today is the Hatter House and it's Lori and her husband. They do taste tests. There's lots of videos from the past that I haven't gotten to yet because I'm trying to watch Vlogmases. But I will catch up after Vlogmases. But I have been watching all of her newer stuff. She does taste testings. Um, they, they try new stuff so that you know whether you might want to watch it. Anyway, or try it. And I really like watching them. I don't know. They're just relatable to me anyway. So, um, the Hatter House... I'm trying not to yawn, you guys. Um, the Hatter House is my shout-out. And I'll link them down below. I'll try to get a picture of them or with them or something. But I don't know if that'll happen. Because we're just meeting up to exchange. And then they're going to go back. and Because they, they don't have but one grocery store in, in, in the town they live in. And so they come, I'm sure, like do a month's worth of shopping. You know, or... 
quite a bit of shopping. When we lived out that way, we didn't live quite so far. We lived an hour away. Um, or not hour. We lived 35 minutes out of town. We lived in a tiny, tiny village that had no grocery store. But we would come into town and do like a week's worth. So, yeah. Um, so, they probably get, like, they do like one big haul once a month and then get other stuff at Lowe's and stuff is what I'm guessing because that's what I would do but yeah so um she they're coming into town so we're just gonna swap I thought I was gonna be waiting longer but they're already in town and they're gonna be there soon so I thought you were gonna get a shot of me crocheting in the van again but I won't be there that long and then I'll be back home and uh, I'll try to do my little I'm gonna get a video put together today I'm gonna do it I told myself I was gonna do every day of vlogmas and I have videoed a little bit each day like even if it's just a tiny clip of opening something but I haven't done a video put a video out every single day so I feel kind of bad about that but um my fibro or whatever's going on with me it, it just doesn't let that happen some days I don't know if I've told you guys but um my doctor put me back on lupus meds because I guess my blood work showed something perky. And like I said, I can't remember if I've told you guys this because I've kind of been, my brain's been foggy. Um, but they put me on some, uh, I guess something was kind of weird with my uh, blood work. And then that day that my hips hurt so bad that I couldn't get out of bed, I had texted my doctor and I was like, I need something or I need to come see you because my hips, both my hips hurt so bad I can't get out of bed. Like, I can barely get to the bathroom. I'm bent over, get to the bathroom. Thank goodness the bathroom isn't that far away. And LJ even had to bring, we keep our camping toilet, our camp toilet, our bucket, our camping bucket um, for just in case I have one of those days and I can't get to the bathroom. Like, I literally am going to have to, like, just go right as soon as I am able to get out of bed. I know that's probably TMI. Anyway, and so, um, that's why we're trying to get the room rearranged and cleaned because we do have one of those bedside commodes that I think we're going to put there. That just sounds awful, don't it? But it's the truth. It's better than, like, having an accident on yourself. So, long story to tell you that I had texted her and told her that. And so she's taking me off the sulfasalazine, which was for my back and hip pain. Yeah, that's the med. I'm on so many now that I can't remember. I'm putting me back on the plaquiloquine. Hydrochloroquine is the generic name. I can't, for whatever reason, remember how to say the, the name name. So, which is for lupus. I mean, it's for, uh, it's, it's for lupus pretty much. And so, because she just doesn't know what's going on with me, which is always nice to hear. And it, I mean, I don't fault my doctor. From what I understand, like you have to hit certain markers before you're exactly diagnosed with lupus. So it can be, you can either be one that, which I mean, it's good that I haven't hit that stage yet because I do know people that don't get diagnosed till they're severely ill and have never been on meds. And so hopefully if that's what's going on with me, I get put on meds and it will help the progress, stop slow or stop the progression of it. However, slow it down, I'm assuming. So yeah, um, I don't know how I got off on that, but um, today is one of those days maybe that's what's time out where once I get back home I'm probably gonna be in bed I'm gonna try to stay awake and crochet although I did get a chance to nap this morning um, I didn't sleep good last night but I was still groggy so I drank a cup of coffee and the hot cocoa bomb my sister gave me yesterday and I ate some eggs and then I was like I'm real sleepy and so he let me sleep about 30 minutes because I told him I was like, you know having to meet up with Lori and um so yeah, he woke me up and um, then I looked and she had messaged me and said that, well, told me and I was like, wow, she like literally messaged right after I closed my eyes. And so, sorry guys, give me a minute. Um, so yeah, 
I was like, oh, I gotta throw some clothes on. So I'm not looking my best, but like I said, I'm not going inside anywhere. I'm just, let's just be honest. I never look my best, <laughs> hardly ever, but yeah. So today is just a chill day after this. Um, I don't know if we'll even work on the room any or if I'll just relax, relax. Uh, LJ, he's such a sweetheart. He goes back to work tonight because he's off on Fridays and Saturdays. He's doing dishes right now. And he's going to go do some laundry. So we have that done. Because he knows I'm in pain. Um, I don't give him enough credit. He is absolutely amazing, y'all. So, okay. Well, I have got to concentrate now. So, love y'all. I'll be back in a minute. Okay, so no pictures. We just got to chatting. So, um, she did give me a bag of stuff. Which was so sweet of her. So, I will open that later. Um, I gave her what I needed to give her and I can't wait to have a picture of the wonderful lady that I made the gloves and the ear warmer for. Um, and I hope that Lori enjoys her ear warmer and her, um, scrunchies. Have I told you how much I don't like even driving in the parking lot in December, um, at Walmart? If I haven't, it's a thing. It completely causes anxiety. Because there's too many people crossing. I'm just sitting here. I hate that. So yeah, I'll be back later. Hi, y'all. I'm back from my little trip to meet Lori um, from Hatter House. I did not get a picture. I think I already told you that. But I do have brought me a, a goodie bag y'all which was so sweet because I feel bad all I gave her some scrunchies and an ear warmer her husband is called the Mad Hatter and so I am gonna crochet him some I'm gonna find a really cool pattern and make him a really cool hat after Christmas when I can really focus on it but I just I feel bad but and she you know she was taking the gift to um my friend's mom that being said my friend's kind of going through a hard time because um I've talked about it before her mom has a whole lot of stuff going on with her brain. They think she's had a stroke. Um, and there's Alzheimer's going. Uh, there's a few things going on. And so Lisa had asked me to make her five inch granny squares. Because she wants to put a sweater together. And I have made some for her. So I was wondering if any of my beautiful subscribers would make her some and send them to me. If you can't because of postage, I understand. That's fine. Or if you don't want to, that's cool too. But if you'd like to, my email is always in the description box. If you email me, I'll give you my address. It, it would just be so appreciated. And I think my friend could really use a pick-me-up right now. Um, I have an idea in January that I hope everybody will participate with me in. But this one is for my friend to kind of give her a pick-me-up. Um, I, uh, I do what I can, but... A few more happy thoughts would be nice if you've ever gone through that with a loved one even just losing a parent watching them waste away with anything is hard but if you've been through the dementia thing then you can um, how, sympathize even more with her I was there with her with her grandma and then LJ's dad and so I do have the idea and plus I her and I graduated together so I know her mom and um yeah so it's a favor to me if you would if not no big deal anyway Lori gave me this it's heavy I don't know what I was in here let's find out y'all want to find out and then I've got my advents and my my swap with the beautiful Bella but yes uh, pretty paper that Neva, Neva doesn't just in case you know if you ever get a bag there won't be tissue paper in it because I'm I don't wrap I don't get I just throw it in there um and poor Bella, all I did was put it in paper bags. But I wanted to be like secret, so. Oh, happy hunting bowl. Eating and full of fun. Healthy diet for dogs. Okay, so I can't see. I don't have my glasses on. But you can probably read what's on there better than I can because I don't know where I put my glasses. Well, I've seen these before. Anyway, I think that'll be really good for Sasha because she's very curious and energetic. So 
Thank you so very much, Lori. Um, that's awesome. A heart shape. That's what it says, but I'm kind of blind, y'all. And my, like I said, my glasses. Let's see. This is coffee, French roast organic. Mm. So I got some coffee. We all know I love my coffee. Ticino. Ticino, is that what it's called? Looks like it, right? Yeah. Oh. I'm sorry I can't read it to y'all. And this one is Ticino. French roast. That's what it looks like in the on the package. It's like she gets a lot of subscription boxes and stuff, y'all. And she does reviews. So if you're ever curious about something, she even takes requests like um if you want her to try something before you do she does that and i think that's way cool like i said she'll be linked down below um i got chocolate y'all oh i love brownies and she um they have peanut butter chips in them i think so yeah, of course it does chocolate chocolate is bad for dogs Let's see. <laughs> all the animals oh these are for is this what you Magic jerky bites bars. They're for for Sasha. Well, and I guess for the other puppers, but for mm -hmm. Sasha because she saw Sasha when I got her, like she saw the video. So, um, um, I'll do a review and a whatever on them when we use them and when I have my glasses, my eyeballs, and I can see. Let's see what is this? I for sure. I think this is the cocoa bomb. Is that it? What does that say that is there? Wrap and wear uh, Luna. It's like a bracelet. Personalized bracelet. Oh, okay. Maybe that was... Okay. Um. You know what? Let's open it. Let's yeah. find out what it is. Oh, it's a whole... You know what? I'll <laughs> open this. We'll do a little unboxing kind of thing for quite a few of these especially when i can see because i hate this i did not <laughs> i know what this is so <laughs> um y'all know that i'm pescatarian so that means the only meat i eat is fish okay so this gets me out of this taste test thank you um they got the limited edition i can see that part and figgy pudding is very blurry but i can make it out partly because i know what this is because they tried it <laughs> and she said she was sending lj some so bring um, it down look y'all it's figgy pudding spam <laughs> flavor spice and everything nice i will record him <laughs> trying this yes yes i will mm, lunchtime mm. i'll eat the whole thing too watch me <laughs> in front of you <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna make this video too long. What's this one? Mushroom ground coffee. What? What? With lion's mane. That's a type of mushroom. I do know that. Jesus. That's the only part that I could see. I have never heard of mushroom ground coffee, so wow. I will taste test this one. I will take the bullet for this one. Gladly will <laughs> I at least get a caffeine high, even if I don't like it. Over, I might be sick. <laughs> Even if I did eat meat, so <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say. And then there's more sweets. I, I, those look. Can you read what they are? Copico coffee candy. Oh yeah. If it's coffee, it's Neva. I love coffee candy. Yes, yes it is. And this is. Oh, I love chapsticks. How did you know that? I never have enough chapsticks. My favorite is the candy cane. From Chapstick, and um, I like the pumpkin spice, but believe it or not, it's not my favorite. My favorite is the peppermint. And is this jewelry? What? Neva needed to put her glasses on for this. I can't see. But I got Chapsticks. Never have enough Chapsticks, y'all. Chapstick and lotion. And, oh, so <laughs> Kiyoshi likes the bag. Or not Kiyoshi. Hagrid likes the bag. <laughs> he says thank you. He's all the way in there, too. Look, guys. I got a bag full of cat. Don't let the cat out of the bag. He likes bags and buckets. I've got to make him his own basket. This is pretty. Oh, my goodness. Thank you. 
Oh, that is gorgeous. Isn't it beautiful? Turquoise. Yeah, turquoise is a good color on me. Oh, how pretty. Thank you. You did not have to do all this, but this is so sweet of you. Thank you. Okay. Was that everything? I think it was. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. So, I don't want that. I'm almost getting the whole brownies. Chocolate is bad for you. All the left is the socks and the rocks. <laughs> well, and Bella. We got to do Bella. Oh, yeah. That's right. Here we go. Bella's gift today. You don't know what this is. I did a swap with Bella. I sent her stuff. Nothing compared to what she sent me. I feel terrible. Um, and every day I'm opening. Well, not every day. Once I get caught up, I will go between socks and... But I also have to do a sock today. I, I'm going to be way behind and be doing a bunch of advents at one time if I don't do this. You know what? I'm not doing the sock today. I've taken too much time. Huh? So, here's my ornament. Look at him. I love the Grinch. I just That's my love favorite that. one so far. Huh? Yes. Resting Grinch face. By the way, I reused one of your bags for my friend Mrs. Mom's um, ear warmer and... Fingerless gloves. Lori, he loves the bag. Good job. Um, I reused it today because I recycle. As Heather the Crochet Witch, I will link her down below, will tell you that I recycle because I sent the same box she sent me. I sent it back to her. But I took the stickers off because I loved my stickers. So. What? Oh my gosh. I feel terrible because I didn't send nothing like this, but why I'm crying is because my mom, when we were kids, every year bought us a Hallmark ornament. And then she gave them all to us after my dad died and she didn't have her own house anymore. And throughout the years I've lost them and whatnot, I do have some of them still, but I've not put up a tree since she died, so... Not only do I love Eeyore, but this makes me think of my mom. Because she gave me a Hallmark ornament, you guys. Aww. I'm sorry, I'm a crybaby. Lori's gift overwhelmed me, and then just... Well, Bella. Hallmark ornaments always make me think of my mom, and my daughter wants me to start the tradition back giving them ornaments and then grandbabies when I have them. And I'm all for that. This year it didn't happen. We were just, but she just came up with the idea this year. So she's got to give me time to prepare, right? But, um, wow. I was not planning. I already cried when I was talking to my friend Lisa, letting her know that what I gave Lori to give to her mom and, yeah. Okay, well. <sighs> Yesterday it was anxiety. Today it's... I don't know. Um, we have my rocks and crystals and glass. <laughs> Advent. We need to open day 11. I can't believe it's already day 11. Um, to see what's in there. This one is a real rock. And it's very pretty. It's a very pretty green. Isn't that pretty, babe? Yeah. I like that. So, there's that. Much better than the... Yeah, it's I'm just going to say that. It doesn't matter what it is today because my day has just been made. No one ever has to give me anything or anything. But when someone shows kindness, even if it's just reaching out in an email because I haven't made videos... Y'all don't know how much it means to me because I do know in this world we need more kindness. And I know that it is very hard to get through all the BS in the world. And so I appreciate it. Um, oh, I think this is the only other one I have today. And it is our 12 
copies from around the world. I'm like trying to sneak out the back there. I've never done that. I've never snuck out of anywhere. But my copy apparently is up to no good. <laughs> hmm. But in case you don't know, there are 12 packs of coffee, which make two cups of coffee. At least in our little Keurig thing it does. And they're from different countries. And I don't look. I just reach. And probably can't read what where they're from today. But, but thank goodness, LJ can let us know. Let me see if I can read it. <laughs> Sumatra. I don't. Okay, I'll just have to read it to y'all, and y'all, well, y'all can probably read it too. But. Sumatra Mandaling. Makes a perfect pot full of fresh roasted coffee every time. Where is Sumatra Mandaling? It sounds Indian, but I could be wrong. Okay, well, y'all can do what I do. I'm going to Google it when I get off of here, because I do not have another device to Google it on, and I have no eyeballs right now. I mean, I have eyeballs, but they're not functioning, right? You're two eyes short of four. Yes. I don't <laughs> have I don't have my extra eyeballs, so I can see. He is really loving this bag. Like, he is in here just having the time, <laughs> the time of his life. They're Bella so will love this, because Bella loves seeing Hackers. Let Bella have some Hagrid fun there in the bag. Hi, Hagrid. <laughs> He's the co-host today. Sasha's the one that got the treats, but looky there. He's just loving. And I love the bag because, yeah, there's a butterfly. There's a, the, butter, the butterfly on it alone is just beautiful. Right. No one's going to be able to, I'm not going to be able to reuse the bag. <laughs> Do you know that now? Like, it's going to be full of your fur. And, um, all wrinkled up. But if you're happy, that's, of course, all that matters. You're not even listening to me. Well, there you go. Not even my cat listens to me. Actually, he's having fun with the string right now. He's just, y'all, yeah, he's living his best life in a bag. Sometimes I wish I could hide in a bag. Yesterday when I was in Walmart, I wish LJ could have put me in a bag. Don't mind my cat. Because, thank you, Lucy. She scratches everywhere but inside the litter box. Just saying. Here we go again. Next to it. Not in it. Next to it. I don't know what that's supposed to cover up. But, anywho. Um, yeah. Wish I could have climbed into a bag and LJ just taken me out with the groceries. I was so anxious and just wanted to get out of there. Um, yeah. I don't know if I'm catching what my kids have. I told you I took tea by my, my, to my daughter. One of the daughters that live here is sick. I don't feel sick, but I am tired. And a cup of that tea that I gave my daughter sounds real good. So I might be having tea here in a little bit. After my coffee from Sumatra Mandaling. Yeah. Um, because, of, you know. I, I did already, I'll tell you, I already had a cup of coffee, and today's just a whole lot of liquid. I drank my um, cocoa bomb. From, I want more of those. I was so surprised. I've never had one. The little marshmallows busted out of it. Like, surprise, we're here. That's cool. So now I gotta get me some just so I can see that, because that was kind of a cool thing. Yeah, I know. I'm strange, and probably very sheltered as far as, like, stuff that's out there. I'm, I mean, I like hot chocolate, but when if I'm going to search something out, it's not really hot chocolate. It's coffee or tea. So now I know that I can have another addiction, which is cocoa bombs. So, shimmy, shimmy, cocoa it? bomb. But yes, so, okay. I will open some of this that I couldn't open today on camera, and we'll see what it is. Probably not today, but one day we will... Uh, film LJ eating figgy pudding spam because that's going to be hilarious to me. LJ will record himself opening the Pokemon today and Lucy wants to mess Kyoshi up. Hagrid's not doing nothing. He's in a bag. Y'all, mm -hmm. I want to get a little y'all don't think I'm weird. I want one of those little baby holders but for a cat so I can carry Hagrid around like this or, oh. Okay. <laughs> like he's gonna do something and then i also want a cat backpack because i think it would be cool to take haggard with me oh his little paws are warm you're warm 
Team lay on mom later on my day key bonds. Okay. Cat fight is about to break out. <laughs> Kiyoshi and Lucy are fine with each other ex until every once in a while one of them gets wild air up their butt and they act crazy. And that's about to happen, so I gotta go. I love y'all. I'll be back in a little bit. Okay, if y'all remember, I said I had an acquisition. Well, um, if you don't watch Maximum Yardage, you should. She's a YouTuber. Well, she has an Etsy shop. She dyes yarn. Okay. So I'm watching her and then I looked at her Etsy shop. I always do that whenever I'm watching somebody. If they, you know, sell something, I try to check it out. So anyway, the package came. And this is her one of her pups. The other one's on the other side, but you can see my address and everything. So let me pause it so I can cover everything up. Okay, so there's the other pup. And I just love that she puts her pups on there. So, yeah. Um, so, anyway, let's open this and see what I got. Let me, I'm going to lay it out because I'm recording this by myself. And then I'll turn it back on. Okay, so here's the card. And it's got a code for me to use on my next order, which I think is awesome. And then she wrote a note on the back, which I just love that it's personalized, like literally a handwritten note. Um, I just thought that was sweet because we don't know each other. I would love to get to meet her someday if I make it to California, because I think her and I would have a blast together. But yeah, so there's her. I love that watercolor look right there, but it says my maximum, well, my maximum yardage. So I will link her down below and then you can go check out our Etsy shop because it's linked in her um, you know, her description box of her videos. Then there's a candy cane that thank goodness she bubble wrapped it cause it did break, but if she hadn't, it probably would have been crushed, but I love candy canes. So yay. I have not ate one yet for Christmas. So oh, my, my dog baby just saw that there's bubble wrap and she's leaving cause she hates bubble wrap. She's a big chicken when it comes to bubble wrap. She will go hiding like there's a drive by. So if you can see the pretty color of the candy cane, I'm not going to unwrap it right now. And a tea, which I absolutely love tea. Chai spice. Yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy in my tummy. Anyway, so I like chai. So that makes me happy. And stash teas are always good. So I'm happy with that. Then let's see if I can do this one-handed. Let's see, she's got her little logo there, which I, like I said, I love it. I love the watercolor effect. Um, this is wrapping it, so I really don't want to rip that, but I don't see me being able to slide it off with one hand. Okay, so, oh, I got to tell you, I was looking at her shop. I didn't even tell you. I was looking at her shop, and she had one called Krampus. In case y'all don't know, I love folklore. I love, um, I had the word just a second ago in my cryptids. I love all that stuff. Sasquatch and Loch Ness and to hear about Krampus and Chupacabra and all of that. Like I'm down for all of those legends and all of it. Okay. So she had one named Krampus. Now she had a Grinch one that I was so tempted to get since the, um, title of my Christmas this year is Scroogey Grinchmas. Have we wish you a Scroogey Grinchmas. I was so tempted to get Grinch, but I wanted to know what this one looked like and it didn't show a picture. And I'm all about the Krampus. I was sad because we didn't get to go to the Krampus Festival um, for lots of reasons. And I think that might have been the day I woke up and I could not get out of bed. So I don't remember exactly why, but yes. So let's look at it together, y'all. Oh my goodness. Okay, so it's got her stuff on there. It's got her logo. And let me see if I can slip this off with one hand. So you can look at all the beauty mess because it looks cool. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Look at this. You did such a wonderful job. It's like oh so Christmassy. But then gets kind of dark, you know, like a mood, I guess, down in here. Oh my gosh, and it's got speckles. I love speckles. <gasps> what am I going to make with it, y'all? 
y'all know my knitting so i can't i don't oh, i want to make something right away maybe i'll wait till my knitting gets better and i'll just hang it somewhere it's so pretty and this is my favorite part that green and that red are perfect together for christmas and krampus is the opposite of santa if y'all don't know about krampus i should do a little spiel before christmas about it but yeah oh my gosh it is so squishy oh my gosh oh i'm in love this is awesome i will buy another hank when i have the money of something this is awesome and i love watching her videos because <laughs> she shows herself dying and it's hilarious okay i love y'all there's my acquisition okay this will be the last of my video um i haven't shown you my blanket and i really haven't done much since the last time you saw it um, I'm going to work tonight on putting the rest of them because I'm only up to, I just started, as you can see, row eight with the red. So, um, but here's the beginning. And it's, it's very pretty. I am really loving this. And I have a request for, an, um, two different requests for me to make them this blanket. So awesome, awesome, awesome. But yeah, I am really enjoying this pattern. It's so easy to remember once you get going. And I love it. And I can't wait till it's done. I mean, I don't want Christmas to come already. I'm enjoying Vlogmas, but I'll be happy to see what it looks like when it's done. I might have to slow down a little because I don't want it huge. And if I keep... Anyway. But I'm going to add up to the 11th. And we're going to see how long it is when next time you see it. So there you go. Ooh, that looks kind of cool makes you a little dizzy though don't it okay so um y'all ha stay scroogey stay grinchy stay spooky and creepy <gasps> that rhymed <laughs> and i will see you tomorrow i love y'all bye hey guys guess what pokemon advent time so let's see this is day 11 i haven't opened it yet but it's open anyway and we got meowth one of his eyes is supposed to be closed and the other one's open. Get it? Because he's a cat, so it's just like a slit. But and he's the right color. Yeah, he's the right color this time. Well, a little coin on this head is supposed to be yellow, but I guess whatever color that is, red or whatever, goes. That's cool. All right, cool. I got another one. Thank you, Advent. Okay, this will be the last of my video. Um, I haven't shown you my blanket, and I really haven't done much since the last time you saw it. Um, I'm going to work tonight on putting the rest of them because I'm only up to, I just started, as you can see, row eight with the red. So, um, but here's the beginning. And it's, it's very pretty. I am really loving this. And I have a request for, an, um, two different requests for me to make them this blanket. So awesome, awesome, awesome. But yeah, I am really enjoying this pattern. It's so easy to remember once you get going. And I love it. And I can't wait till it's done. I mean, I don't want Christmas to come already. I'm enjoying Vlogmas, but I'll be happy to see what it looks like when it's done. I might have to slow down a little because I don't want it huge. And if I keep... Anyway. But I'm going to add up to the 11th. And we're going to see how long it is when next time you see it. So there you go. Ooh, that looks kind of cool. Makes you a little dizzy though, don't it? Okay. So, um, y'all ha stay scroogey, stay grinchy, stay spooky and creepy. <gasps> that rhymed. <laughs> and I will see you tomorrow. I love y'all. Bye.